The weather has been a little too dry for a little too long across the UP. Local 3's Audrey Pentecost has more. Dry conditions across Michigan's Upper Peninsula have caused elevated fire concerns. Over the last week, the UP has seen no significant rainfall and weather has remained dry. Dry conditions are still expected over the next week as well. Historically, if we go back and look, right now we're I think at about 12 days here locally without any measurable precipitation. Uh, the record for the number of days in a row at our office is 24 days in a row. But with the prospects of basically very little to no rain over the next 10 days, we'll be creeping up that list and maybe even make it in the top five for the number of straight days with little to no precipitation. With the dry conditions, there are elevated fire concerns across the UP. Some burn restrictions have been put into place to prevent potential wildfires. The, uh, the important thing is obviously limiting the outdoor burning and using as much caution as possible if you do have uh, a of campfire going and things like that. We're not to the stage yet where there's complete bans in effect for having fires, but people need to check with their local areas where they're living to make sure different ordinances aren't putting, being put into place to limit the, the fire uh, potential as we continue in this dry stretch. Along with these dry conditions and elevated fire concerns, air quality is low due to smoke from wildfires in Quebec being pushed over the UP. Uh, right now, obviously, if people are uh, prone to respiratory conditions and asthma, things like that, they're probably noticing uh, the contaminants in the air today and allergy sufferers, obviously, too. Uh, I myself, this day has probably been my worst day so far this early spring or late spring and early summer with all the, uh, the poor air quality. But things should begin to improve here over the next couple of days. For more information about how to find burn restrictions in your area, find the story on our webpage. Reporting in Marquette, Audrey Pentecost, Local 3 News.